Hey guys, it's Tyler Rollinson and welcome back to another Charlton vlog. Today is Charlton Athletic versus Plymouth Argyle and today the Addicts really should be picking up the three points today. Plymouth are bottom of the league and they are the only side in the division that haven't won a game yet. Whereas Charlton are on a three game win streak. However, this is the sort of game that Charlton are going to end up going and losing to. Which is why... It could be a really difficult game today because Plymouth will be going all guns blazing for today's game. They will be eager to finally get off the mark with their first win and Charlton will be looking to extend their unbeaten run and win streak. But this is the kind of game that we are going to end up losing. Now, of course, Plymouth are going through a really torrid time in the league right now. And to sum it up, they are without three key players. I think Ness is injured. I think Grant is injured and there's someone else, I can't remember. But Plymouth do have quite a solid team anyway. They have quite a decent uh, decent enough players. Uh, they've got Graham Carey, they've got Stuart O'Keefe they signed from Portsmouth in the summer. And they've also got Ruben Lameras, who are pretty decent players. Cholton also have some injury worries of their own. With Nikia Jose, Darren Prattley and Christian Balik all out injured for another maximum of about a week or two weeks. Billy Clark is returning to training in the space of next week, which is brilliant news because we've missed him very dearly. Fosu is serving his final match ban today. And of course, Jake Forstokaski is, of course, long gone out of the season, but underwent ACL treatment recently and was very successful. So he is on now on the road to recovery. But despite Charlton's injury rows, we are in ridiculously good form, especially with our two strike partners, Lyle Taylor and Carlin Grant. Between them, they have scored eight goals this season. Taylor with five, Grant with three. And they both scored two in our 2 0 win against Bradford City, and they were absolutely incredible goals. So they will be looking to, the, to continue their good form against a poor Plymouth side who are in ridiculously bad form right now. Is the type of game that Charlton are going to go and end up losing because we all know Charlton, we all end up losing games that we're not expecting, that we expect to pulverise and we never end up doing it and we end up getting smashed ourselves but I'm being very overly confident today mainly because I know the quality of our team and I know that we should be coming away with the win and I'm going with a 3-0 win to Charlton today this should be a very easy victory but Plymouth they will be up for it they will definitely be up for it but also remember Plymouth were the very first team that Bowyer took on as manager of Charlton and we smashed them 2-0 didn't even let them have a, um, have a whimper in the game. It was unbelievable game. Lewis Page and Michael Giro scoring in that game as well. Can we repeat our success? We don't know, but we are expected to win. But as I keep saying, this is the kind of game that we're going to lose. But let's just not think about the negatives and let's just get the win against Memphis goal and extend our winning record to form to four. Let's do this. Comedy Reds! <laughs> One change to leave on your side. Saar comes in for the injured foul. Let's hope that Charlton can keep their run for winning four going against Plymouth. Come on, you Reds! came in and an easy header beat Page too easily and Plymouth have taken the lead for the second home game in a row Charlton are one nil down so God, this is the type of game we end up losing got to show fight now coming your Reds
rid of it. Get rid of it. Hey, get it top. You did cut. Boom. Another corner. Another corner. We'll have it. Decent. Ah. Oh. Good boy. Good boy, Josh. Lucky boys, come on. Second goal's gonna come, come on. Right, so we're just about past the half hour mark. Chowan, they're looking good. They're looking good so far. I think the bottom of the league, never for actually putting on a good show. They're actually playing quite well. I don't think that their performances really show, I don't think their uh, results really show their performances because I don't think they deserve to be bottom of the league. Charlton are, have had the more, have had the more scary chances of the game. Plymouth have been creating our defences have got rid of it most of the time, but in quite scrappy situations. But Charlton are looking a better team at the moment, and hopefully it will get the second goal just before just before the break. Come on, your reds. I said we needed a second goal, and we've got it. Charlton have a penalty. What a ball from Taylor. Played into Grant, I think, and then someone got fouled, and it's a penalty. Taylor's going to have it, and this will be 2-1. Taylor's sick of the season. Come on, Charlton. Come on, Taylor. Come on. Was. Try not to foul anyone with this one. Another chance, Solly. In the box, Reeves. John Cullen. Nice, uh, nice idea. Well done. John Cullen. Nice ball, go on Taylor. Stay down, you gimp. Honestly, I've no idea how many corners Charlton have had this half. It's unbelievable. This is their tenth corner or something, and it's led to a free kick from them every time. Let's hope this one. Isn't it? No. One out. Oh, he scores. Half time. Charlton one, Kenneth one. We're the better team so far. But we all know Bo, your second half team talks. Charlton come out guns blazing in the second half every game I've been to so far. And hopefully it's the same this one because we deserve to win it. Come on, Charlton. You're giving him too much space. My God. Every time you need to shut that down. Out. No shots. Oh my God. Jesus Christ. Come on, at this they're going to score at this rate. Come on. But up far. Now go, come on, go, go. Go on, Taylor. On your own, mate. On your own. Shot slash crossing into the box and Pierce couldn't get ahead to it, but we're playing exceptional football right now. Bloody brilliant. But the Plymouth keeper, honestly, 
is taking so long. Definitely makes me think I'm not going to draw, but I had no idea how Charlton haven't taken the lead yet. We're all over it. We're playing exceptional. Bloody brilliant from Charlton. Good ball in the box, please, Cullen. Good ball in the box. Oh. The Rebo. No. Another corner. Another corner. Ah. Come on. Oh, no. Not on the counter, not in the counter. Yes! Come on! Come on, Niall! Ah. Come on, the rebound! Go on, Ben! Ah! Go on, Joe! Go on, Taylor! Go on! So want to come close. So many chances. Carlo Grant just got put through after Jamie Ward got fouled. Advantage. Taylor was right there in open space to square it. He's gone for goal and missed it at the near post. So close. Keep your head up, Carlo, mate. Come on. The goal will come. We deserve it. Go on. Ah. Get in there! Jesus fucking Christ, yeah.